Currently about 10,000 U.S. soldiers stationed in the Middle East. All of them anxiously awaiting reunions with their families. That includes a three-year-old dog living in Tennessee. Tonight, News Channel 5's Chris Conti and photojournalist Catherine Stewart have this trip of a lifetime. Hey. Answering the call is in Blue's DNA. How could it not be? What is she doing? Considering her owner answered the call to serve in the Middle East. There's always a worry. You never know what you never know what goes on. Of course, and this is Andrew. Mitzi Foley in his uniform overseas has not seen her son in nine months. He makes us proud. And while she may be standing at the Robertson County Airport, Andrew Foley is not coming home today. I was forced protection. He is still 2,000 miles away in Spokane, Washington. I uh, left the beginning of the year. Blue, what are you doing? Are you ready to see Andrew? Where's he at? But one member of the Foley family has a ticket home. He's very excited and anxious for her to be home with him. You're going across the country in one day. Trip so. Costas has answered a call of a different kind. Obviously, you want to see your best friend. We all set? Yes, we're set. Volunteering with pilots and paws. You are a licker. He's helping to fly Blue back to Andrew. We're getting him his dog. With a lot of help, <laughs> we're getting him his dog. I missed you. Goodbyes are the reality for this military family. Yeah. Blue, though, was in good hands. All right. Oh, yeah. Right at home. <laughs> So I'm going to give you your safety briefing. Hi, boo. Taxied for takeoff, Mitzi could only watch from the runway as the two took off. There goes my blue baby. She knows this feeling all too well, being forced to let go of someone she loves. <laughs> At least I know where she's going. This mother's worries, though, would have been grounded if she could have peered into the cockpit. Normally the dog has not seen that view of the horizon before. It's kind of a unique experience. Trip would fly Blue to Illinois, where a different volunteer pilot then took her to Nebraska. In Nebraska, an upgrade to first class and finally on to Spokane, where Andrew stood waiting to see his best friend. Hey! 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 Apprehensive at first. She just wants to see everybody. Hey! Then Blue, all at once, realized who she was with. She wants to see everybody. Hey, baby. A reunion, 2,000 miles and nine months in the making. Speechless, I'm really happy to have my best friend back. There's no way we could ever repay them. I don't know, I don't know that, you know, there's nothing we could ever do to repay them. It is impossible to find the good in war. Finding the good in humanity, look no further than this airport tarmac. There is good in this world and there's good in people. Yeah. Okay. Isn't that the truth? Andrew had a cookout with his army buddies in Blue's honor when he got home on Friday night, but he says Blue needs to go on a bit of a diet after vacationing with her grandparents the last few months.